Can get out? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm getting it. Mickey, you want to get out of here? say about Ari? He's a Hollywood producer. He's doing okay. He's got some great ideas, some great scripts, let me tell you. They're on the, they're on the pipeline. They're gonna happen. About identity, chaos, desperation, drugs, sex. Um, yeah, and it just takes on this ride that... And, the <laughs> and you're in an egg chair. And yeah, this is my little womb. I'm in a womb. <laughs> God bless you. The Greeks, the Greeks. God bless you. Eddie's. Anthony's. Anthony's, Anthony's, Anthony's become Anthony's Eddie. Eddie. Okay. okay. Um, Mr. Mint. Early bird, they brought you by the good people at Mr. Mint, Vietnamese. Yeah. Yeah. It's still in the dark city streets. Studio until all hours of the morning, starting early in the morning. Um, so my voice has um, suffered. In me. I recently stumbled across the definition of love: giving someone the power to destroy you and trusting that they won't use it. So uh, for me, the misuse of power is. is the key, the the uh, main theme in Hurley Burley um, that I think is really interesting to explore and reflect upon in present time. So that is uh, is certainly um, certainly a big difference. But I had to find uh, the bridge for we've got our own paranoias, we've, uh, we've we've got our own uh, insecurities, and uh, it's how we deal with that. So that feels like I go the substance route, but I've got my own ways, and uh, I try to bring them in. Phil, uh, Hurley Burley. Uh, Phil is violent. He's psychotic. He's an actor. Driving a lot of that is his own paranoia that he is loved, that he is accepted, and I can at least relate to parts of that to connect with some of the behaviour that. 